Here we go. Game one. <laughs> I can't believe this. I actually believe that Beast could actually, like, really do well in this matchup. Beast plays Charizard. Yeah, there is literally matter. nothing that is out of reach of this uh, stubby arm uh, lizard. And that's, and that's what makes it so funny. So anyway, yeah, game one. Samus. Oh, oh Lord. Oh, boy. Is he going to get it? This is a, no, good, this is a it. good start. Oh, that's a power oh. move right there. Not going to be enough. Samus uh, surprisingly heavy. Well, not really. She's wearing like a full body armor suit. Uh. But finally, that falling forward air from the platform going to take that first stock. Only 48 damage. And Charizard's a chunky boy. That is a sizable lead. Yeah. Uh, only 40 seconds uh, into the game, and we're already out of stock. Uh, putting Zach well out of his element. <laughs> you know, Beast is uh, really good at two things, and that's rushdown and just super good aggressive like uh, boxing. Yeah. The other thing is that like e like you can actually see that like the way that Beast took this uh, that first stock. Uh, actually kind of shows why he would want to go to a stage like PS2 because he has that option to just cover by sitting on that platform so he can always do a drop down fair, which is really like a really powerful edge guard situation that you can be mm -hmm. in. So he's just like, oh yeah, PS2? Yeah, yeah, totally. Let's go to the starter stage. Just neutral as hell. Fool. <laughs> My favorite. <laughs> anyway, uh... Both on their second stock, I completely miss how Charizard died, but that doesn't really matter. We're back to even stocks, even percentages here. Whoa. Oh, yeah, man. Yeah, just fitting the roll, but not, like, timing properly. <laughs> Peace with the zero fear. Yo. Just got up and jumped over that. I really like the fact that I like how Beast like stood still in his shield in that platform, knowing that, like, you know, it's Wi-Fi, so you have to be extra predictive. He is... He is baiting this man's up bees, and while he isn't like uh, being able to punish them yet, just the fact that he's like getting a feel to bait those moves out means that he'll be more equipped to time and get the punish for at later. You know, he doesn't have to get the punish right away, but as long as he knows that he can try and force it out, he can make he can wait for it till it like he's comfortable to actually go for a hit. Ooh, dash attack into dash attack into dash attack. Finally going to take that uh, second stock. Now Zach in a bit of a lead here. 97 damage. Uh, definitely, like, not too healthy. Uh, definitely has to do something before. Ooh. I feel like it maybe be at a run off there, but then it would have been pretty difficult to capture uh, such a floaty character, so I understand the apprehension. Ooh, I yeah. like that. Rage Relief into uh, Vine Whip just barely missed. Okay. We're going back to the old standby. Going back to the big He's boy. Like All right. Uh, yep. Drop shield, turn around, and uh, up smash. That is one advantage that Charizard actually does have in this match is that he has access to a really good move out of shield that's really destroying to the front of him. So and you know he that reacts just in time. And Got you know it. he had to read that roll because dropping dropping and then turning around and do up smash even if like even if that turnaround was like frame perfect it's minimum going to be like 13 to 14 frames so yep. uh yeah my man's definitely uh trying to read uh -oh. that magazine Ooh! yeah oh, oh my god dude come on let's go that's such a beast thing to do yo that was definitely beast my goodness. Wow, let's see that again. Oh, ooh, so good. Charizard's kind of viable? What? Because he just kills people at like 60 sometimes? Character is OD. I love this character. He's hilarious. Big stupid dragon. Oh my god, he killed so, him at 66. So dirty. He just back, <laughs> he just back him at 66. Ooh, ooh. I cannot believe that triple, that triple dash attack counts. Alright, well, Beast is up 1-0. It looks like uh, we're actually going to Lila. 
Question is, uh, is Zack staying or is he changing off of Samus? I can He's like, exactly yo, give me like... that crusty ass Sonic. Your crusty Samus ain't shit. Let me yeah, see that boy. <laughs> he's saying, Lila Picker, not surprise, LMAO. And yes, he's going Sonic. Charizard bears an absurdly strong hitbox, dude. It's so lo it's so big. Yeah. Yeah, it is. <laughs> oh, yeah, it is. Yeah, I don't really, like, get what... <laughs> you think that you're out of range of it, but you're never out of range. <sighs> Alright, we do it, Flare Blitz, right <laughs> off the bat. Balls to the wall. The fire is in him and around him and just, just everywhere. He's like, this worked the last match. I read him so hard. I'm gonna do it again. Oh, crap, I missed. I'm off stage. You know what? Whatever. It's Flare Blitz. You, you just didn't take a little bit of damage. You're good. Okay. Ooh, ooh, okay. ooh, ooh. Falling up air to, to Nair. Crazy. Nair, yeah. This is a heavy, so he's gonna he's gonna get hit a lot, but he's gonna eventually like get those uh, counter punches. And he doesn't need to land as many to get the kill. Oh, he went for the wrong option. He read he read it, he read it correctly, unfortunately, and that ended up costing him the stock. All right. Uh... <gasps> Zack doing a pretty good job of avoiding some damage here, but now in a pretty precarious situation. Oh, still not out of it, and Jeez. never makes it out. Beast definitely kept that pressure going. Uh, excellent Crazy play. DI follow. Excellent Very play nice. with uh, Ivysaur. And I really like that he just put that Vine Whip through the stage just for good measure. That's something that Ivysaur can take advantage of, especially on Lilac because it's thin. Uh, and using that just to stay under and then turn into Charizard during his recovery. Uh, but now, you know, 120 damage to zero, 36 now, uh, like, he's got, he's got his work cut out for him. What can he do? Why does that move jump? Why can you jump in that move during the charge? Good lord. Anyway, uh, runoff, runoff, uh, fair, uh, actually gonna be pretty good, because it's, like, it's decently disjointed, and, like, he's already committed to the, uh, to the spin dash, so, like, he can either, you know, retreat to make to like lose even more stage advantage when uh, Beast had neutral, or had center rather. So yeah. Okay, so uh, that forward air was actually the only forward air that Zach was going to take uh, for that entire stock. Uh, able to now bring Be Beast to his last stock here and now trying to catch him with Nair. Okay, all right, boom, boom. Uh, no, second boom, there's the second boom. Ah, wow. So, Zach, even on Wi-Fi, able to, you know, he tried to time the uh, letting go of Spin Dash, where it ha when he does a little hop, he's actually... Ooh! Oh, my God! He just did it! He just charged that up smash! It's Bro. so big, he was actually able to outrange Spin Dash. These reads are hilarious. My man's is in his soul. Yeah, so Razor really not really doing the job for these, like... Zack just keeps eating them up with spin dashes. Yeah, because, like, remember, the little hop is invincible, and, you know, it doesn't do a lot of damage, so, like, he could just, like, clink, or he can eat it out. Yeah. Uh, not really the best projectile for this situation. But sometimes you just gotta throw something out, right? Oh, my God. Bro, just commit to the shield. Just commit to the shield. Yeah, like, Sonic's not gonna break your shields from dashing. Yeah, it, it's Wi-Fi. Like they have to be predictive anyway. So like, as long as you keep it mixed up. But like, if you're gonna if you're gonna commit to that shield, like you did hold that long enough. So just just hold, just wait. Cause uh, like, commit to the read is basically what I'm saying. Yeah. Sonic has Beast in kind of a precarious position. Beast might still be able to take the stock though if he manages to get at least Ooh. some kind. Oh! All right, now it's suddenly scary again. Oh, oh! oh my goodness! All and right. this is even. This is super even now. Uh oh. Uh oh. If he gets hit, be if he gets hit by any of those spin dashes, it could put him in a situation to get hit by uh, forward air. 
Beast is just the only one getting any no! hits right now. Oh, he got kicked in the face. got kicked in the face, bro. He got kicked in his little dragon face. And after almost choking it out, he's like, that was too easy. Wow. I don't know if that's actually what you heard. I think he might have said that. I think he did say that for you, too. But, uh, gosh darn. Wow. Gosh darn, man. He hit him on one of his little horns. Charizard's oh, and his little, little, his little, little hat spikes? Yeah, his little baby horns. Had really yeah, you're right, he did. Horns. Something a lot of people don't realize is that oh, when, God, people, look at the, oh, when this characters... Oh, this guard is so good. Oh, uh, yeah. Ugh! Number four, yeah. I'm, 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 I'm tweeting that. That's a really good edge guard. Yeah, I really like the, uh, the, up, the up smash explosion one. That was really good, too. All right, so it looks like we are going to PS2, which is totally a uh, beast thing to do. I don't expect to see any more Lilat, honestly, after that first match. Of course it's a beast thing to do. He wants that platform. He wants to be like, yeah, yeah, let me let me improve my edge guards. Significantly. Now we're going into game three. three two, one, go! So let's see. Uh, this is the first time they're fighting on the stage with these two characters. The first time uh, was uh, Samus. So there is going to be a little bit of a change here because those platforms also do help Sonic uh, stay back. Uh, it just gets him a lot of air and him able to just uh, spin shot all the way across the stage. I don't know if he meant to do that, but... Uh, I can see Beast we're still there. big in that big read. I don't know how he could have gone Sonic down there fast enough. But anyway, uh, still really early percents. They haven't really had a chance to interact too much uh, based on one of the, one of the party members' uh, actions. <laughs> oh my goodness. See, Beast, like, he wasn't trusting the, the flare boards there. He's like, let me try to just get like some kind of connect. I'll mess up his tech. A yeah, really you good can't, smash. You can't do... Uh, some characters have trouble punishing uh, homing attack on shield, uh, but Charizard, just his gigantic wings, uh, just can cover that whole spot. So he's he's good on that front. Which actually oh, really? is a really good tool against Sonic in general, because like he's always trying to go for these pot shots anyway. So, yep, trying to read yeah. the up smash again. I, I feel that, honestly. It's like I have to let go at that moment because if he didn't, he was, uh, Peace was going to be able to shield. Oh, perfect. I like super light hit. Ooh, did he die? Oh, he does. I liked how he committed to the block on that platform. Uh, unfortunately, well, unfortunately for him, uh, he got kind of hit afterwards and got taken off stage. Ooh! Ooh, Ooh trying to homing great attack. homing attack. Punish. Homing attack this, stupid. All right, and uh, Beast sticking with Ivysaur right now. Yeah, he's been seeing a little bit of success lately. Maybe he's trying to see if he can try to turn into something bigger. Very nice, yes. Good early combos. I can see that up smash. He was trying to charge there. Alright, just kind of interesting to see like when he's going to make the decision to switch off of Ivy. And then, oh, a big read there. Alright, yeah. uh, 
All right, pretty even percents here. Uh, ooh, all right, going. Ugh. Honestly, that's a really good read to go for because, like, when he had when he's doing charging F smash like under the platform, it's just like how are you gonna really like punish me? Punish that? Yeah. I mean, you do get up attack. That's pretty much yeah. it. Most characters. Yeah, and then with how far back uh, Ivysaur goes, or how much, how far forward forward smash covers, you know, that's gonna do it. But uh, Zach gonna take uh, the second stock. Oh my ooh. God! They keep trading. Tit for tat, man. Just immediate like kills. The only and thing to uh, that Beast needs to worry about is that the progression is he dies first. So uh, if the pass has showed anything so far, right now uh, Zach is slated to win this match. Hilarious, nice little uh, <laughs> going right under the up tilt. It looks Ooh, choreographed. It's so cute. Oh. Ooh, all right. Beast is definitely taking it. Uh, taking oh. measures in. Oh, he got too scared and went too far and went off stage. He's a scared little boy. He went off stage. And that is the fear that Ivysaur puts in mortal men. I think he was honestly expecting to to, to snap to the ledge, but he was just too far. He just drifted too far out there. Oh, he had already air dodged. Oh, yes. Yep. He, he just got, yeah, he, he just got, uh, he got hella spooked, man. And that, yeah, that's... That that take advantage of what Ivysaur's got, man. Especially in that situation, he was putting on so much pressure. The damage was getting up there, and he's just like putting him like Ivysaur wants you above him, and he was. So like he has to also make a read to get out of there, and whew, I you know like on on Wi-Fi, it's hard to react to that little minute movement. You know, he may not have realized that he was just just that much past it, but like, yeah, yeah. Woohoo! It's like you're either I'm gonna kill you, or you're gonna kill yourself. Oh man, here yeah, comes this uh, stupid. Incredible. Right, we're going back to Lilac Cruise. I'm surprised Beast didn't ban it. I wonder what were his bans. Do you know? I don't. I didn't. Um, I didn't get to see either time. Okay. All right. I would well, assume that uh, FD, but yeah. Uh, Beast on uh on set point. All right, so got to run back here to Lilat. Um, you know, Beast leaving it open. Clearly, he thinks that there's something worse. I mean, what is it? It's going to be like FD and Kalos, I would assume. Um, Kalos, I can totally understand getting rid of. FD, uh, you might want to try your chances. But nonetheless, here we are on Lilat. And uh, again, fairly even percentages here. Uh, Zach taking a small lead or just getting more. Ooh. Ooh. See, it, oh doesn't, my see it doesn't matter how much you trade because when you hit as hard as Charizard, then, like, who cares? You dead! And so now Beast taking a really early lead here. Now, 100 damage. He's a chunky boy uh, that's still kind of high, so he does have to be careful. Uh, but now he doesn't have to approach. The burden isn't on him, but he's choosing to approach anyway. He's still trying to go for those reads, bro. I would really consider, especially in the situation when you're in the lead, to, like, maybe hold those... Uh, blocks longer because yeah he, he's gonna predict that you're gonna try and do something especially with how often you're doing it and it's not that passive honestly going right through the spring god well what an uh, what an, like really good kit uh, versus Sonic yeah no it's a lot of uh, super just trying to hit boxes as long as you make those reads properly you're going oh, to be okay. able to punish him super right, hard bro look I, you had the lead that I feel like that was a little bit irresponsible but you know still 60% lead see what you can do uh, sticking with Ivysaur right now uh, if you can get another edge guard situation oh he went for up smash again he absolutely hilarious it. He's like, my up smash outranges your spin dash. If I get this, you're going to die. He was, you know, decently far where he attempted it. The move is 26 frames, uh, which is which is slow. But for a move that strong, it's kind of fast. Yeah, no. Ooh! Oh, my gosh. That's Run sweet spot. Getting it right where he needs it. I appreciate this. Okay, so now oh. we're actually in a better situation than we were in the previous stock because one, yes, we're further into the game and he's on his last stock, but two, with this stock lead, his percent is actually overall lower from the last yep. stock lead that he had. So, Beast is actually making some great uh, progress. Okay. He's, he's actually, like, not really sure what to do. He keeps getting these. That is oh my god, this is so funny. Wow. Beast is so funny to watch. Ah, ah. He just went for another player blitz, man. I think he was, he was expecting to jump out of the net. 
much. I respect that. How funny. All right. This is not looking good for Zach. Zach could still get a kill uh, fairly oh! easily. Yo, let's go with that taunt. Is that going to kill? Right. No, just barely He's surviving. Not do it just yet, but now he's kind of knocking on death's door here. So, uh, you know, it's not in beast nature to, you know, to slow down. So we're just going to see what happens. Uh, he dies, he dies, or he gets the kill, you know. Uh, that shield's looking pretty real, tiny, bro. He's got a real black and white light for here. Actually, no, he's actually doing a really good job of, like, going for these baits. He is actually slowing it down. He, kinda, he knows what's on the line here. He doesn't want to go to a game five. He doesn't want to risk it. So he's definitely, like, pulling back. Trying to do as much as he can to stay out of that burst range, but uh, normal getup gonna finally kick him out uh, into the last stock. But ow! oh my god, the, the sweet spot of B once again that tit for tat. Ooh ho ho! Fantastic play by Beast. That was a real, that was a real treat to watch. I really enjoyed that set. Good stuff uh, by both players, honestly. Uh, Beast, right, let's see. really good job. Wow, that was so fun. That was pretty good. Yeah. That was probably one of the best sets featuring Stonic that I've seen in a very long time. And we got Lyric in the chat cheering on her mans. Yep. Got the support. But yeah, oh, my god, this was so I really like this set. I, I one of my I, I don't know if it it didn't result into a kill, but it was actually really funny when uh, the Zard back air literally caught uh, the spin dash when he was like already like miles behind him it's like my tail is miles bro what what you think you could get away fool <laughs> i just really love the way that uh that beast kept predicting where zach was gonna be and there was a lot of times where he whiffed where he just like missed but like a country mile but those times that he did uh